I'm a homely little bit of tin and bone. I'm beloved by the legion of the lost. I haven't got a very fancy tone, and a dime or two will satisfy my cost. I don't attempt your highfalutin flights. I'm more or less uncertain of the key. But I tell you, boys, there's lots and lots of nights when you've taken mighty comfort out of me. I weigh an ounce or two, and I'm so small you can pack me in the pocket of your vest. And when at night so wearily you crawl into your bunk and stretch your limbs to rest, you take me out, play me soft and low. The simple songs that trouble your heartstrings, the tunes you used to fancy long ago, before you made a rotten mess of things. Then a dreamy look will come into your eyes, and you break off in the middle of a note, and then, with just the dreariest of sighs, you drop me in the pocket of your coat. But somehow I bucked you up a bit, and as you turn around and face the wall, you don't feel quite so spineless and unfit. You're not so bad a fella after all. I'm a humble little bit of tin and horn. I'm a byword. I'm a plaything. I'm a jest. The virtuoso looks at me with scorn. But there's times when I'm better than the best. Ask the stoker and the sailor of the sea. Ask the mucker and the hewer of the pine. Ask the herder of the plain. Ask the gleaner of the grain. There's a lowly, loving kingdom, and it's mine.